Is it a coincidence that the Maui property, owned by million and billionaires, it wasn't touched by the flames while homes of the locals all burned? A governor going on television after a massive tragedy, yeah. and then he starts talking about taking it over from for the state. That's an insane position to take. It is post tragedy yeah. when and people I, I, are suffering at their most. They can't yeah. even believe it happened. Yeah. Tonight from Maui, where Oprah Winfrey recently bought hundreds of acres of ag land and upcountry. Why they blocked people like Kai Lenny and others from using their jet skis and boats to try to bring supplies in through the water. Um, you could say, well, we want, we were trying to secure the area, but you're blocking, you're blocking friends and family from coming in and bringing necessary supplies. You won't believe this. Oprah is in trouble. More heat has been thrown at Oprah and her billionaire friends for what happened to Maui Island. Firstly, the lack of media coverage brought so many questions to the people, but what made it worse was the lack of attention the people of Maui received from the government. Not only did the officials ignore them, they tried to stop well-wishers from helping and taking in necessities. Which is sad and inhuman if you were to ask me. It's quite funny that billions of dollars have been spent on Ukraine while people are suffering in the USA. Not long ago, Candace Owens went off on the government for prioritizing Ukrainian people over their own. Whether you like her or not, Candace made a lot of sense. A lot of things don't add up, and the fire looks like it was planned. Even Elon Musk suggested the people responsible should be prosecuted. Matt Walsh also called for the people responsible to be arrested and imprisoned. This is what he said, just to review, the local government in Maui didn't use the sirens to alert residents to the fire, didn't allow access to water to put out the fire, and blocked the only exits out of town. This is one of the great scandals in American history. Many people should be in prison. I couldn't agree more. The conspiracy theory on this matter is that the elites are trying to take land from the poor people, and there is a high chance they are responsible for the fire. The million dollar questions are, why is it that their mansions were safe but all the houses for the poor people burned to ashes? Why did they try to stop people from exiting? Why did they take so long to send help? Why did the media take little interest in covering what was happening there? There are so many questions that have gone unanswered. Has anyone noticed that no one has interviewed the parents of the children who are missing? We are living in a complicated and evil world. People are still upset and shocked about what happened to the people of Maui, Unfortunately, Oprah and The Rock made it worse by insulting them. That campaign was nothing but theft and mockery. Are we going to see justice for what happened to the people of Maui? Well, let's wait and see. And I was watching uh, the Republican debates and they're sitting here trying to make me cry for people in, in Ukraine. I, are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? Have you looked around America yet? Do you really think that this is what the people at home are going to respond to, perpetually telling them that they have to care about another nation more than their own backyards, that they should be caring more about what's happening in Ukraine and Chris Christie trying to pitch it and you know Pence trying to pitch it and Nikki Haley, you know, we need to be the police officers of the world and we can't even police her. We can do both. No, we obviously can't. Like